Hello everybody, Arctic Ice Fox here and welcome back to, well, this is my first video, welcome to a Minecraft tutorial. Alright, so I'm in the 1.5, uh, not snapshot, pre-release, yeah, I'm in the 1.5 pre-release and as you can tell right now, you might know what I'm going to build. <laughs> It is a vertical conveyor belt sort of thing. <clears throat> and uh, let me show you how it's done. Okay, let's turn that down. There's only one problem with this machine where it's loud. It's louder than some of the others that you've seen, but it's resource light. Yeah, um, it, c it can go up probably 15 blocks or so, uh, due because of the, um, vertical redstone. Alright. It's pretty effective, uh, considering it's not very complicated. It's fairly easy to make. It's, uh, about... 2 by 2 area, well, minus that, that's kind of optional, but, uh, yeah. Alright, let me show you how to make this. Alright, first of all, you would, okay, sorry, before I get onto that, this right here is... Let me show you how it works. It's that a constant pulse is, you know, activating every single one of these simultaneously. That's why, you know, it, it keeps clicking even though um well nothing's in there, so you know it clicks, makes that clicking sound. And basically what if there's nothing in here it'll just click constantly making a really big loud obnoxious noise so all right first of all what you want to do is create a clock it it can be any clock but since this is the fastest clock you can make uh, it's you know best for this so it can send stuff up as fast as possible and you know I see a lot of people try and do this you know that w works but uh, what I like to do is right click and then destroy the block underneath so destroy the torch and it creates a perfect uh, clock with this speed next thing you have to do is make vertical redstone you know like this oh and another thing great about this design is that it's flush with the wall well except this right here but uh it's you know you can create a wall so that you won't have to see any of this back here so it's good for adventure maps i suppose but uh again there's the noise <laughs> so I'm not gonna make it as bit tall as that one, but uh, anyways, just uh, bring this out one block from the actual <coughs> thing from the actual uh, glowstone, so you can do this. Basically, you just do this for every other level. And let's uh, get rid of the lever. Okay, that's getting kind of loud. Chest. Alright, let's see here. 
Sorry. Okay. Let's just do that for now. And a dropper there. All right. So this is pretty much done, so to speak. Uh, let's test it out. Oh, right. Redstone. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's see if it works. Yep. Works like a charm. Except, again, noise level. It's pretty loud. And that's basically all it is. It can go up to 15 blocks, I think, if you um, like move it over one, you can... Well, not move it over one, but add a repeater and you know, extend it up even more. I haven't tested it. Maybe you, um, you guys, the viewers, can check it out. Uh, and in another video, I will show you how to make the toggleable one tick, well, two tick clock. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.